Meteorites rain down on Earth all the time. And when they're found, these little rocks can be valuable nuggets of scientific knowledge. Hey everyone, Trace here, rocking it for the weekly D News Space Update. Get it? Rocking it because we're talking about meteor. No, never mind. Space is full of little bits of material zooming around, and the chances of one falling onto the surface of our planet are pretty high. The high estimate says we're hit with as many as 84,000 pieces of debris every year. A lot of that material burns up in the atmosphere, but some will make it down to the ground. The Meteorite Bulletin is updated daily with the latest found meteorites from across the planet, and a new one from Northwest Africa might be more important than it first appeared. The 4.4 billion year old meteorite, dubbed NWA7533, no, scientists are not really up or keen on the 90s rap jokes, is the first meteorite ever to be recovered that they believe used to be part of the surface of Mars. Using fancy scientific equipment, researchers at Florida State University ran dozens of tests on this little rock. From that, they were able to determine what the meteorite was made of. Comparing it to other meteorites and experiments done by Curiosity on Mars, scientists determined it was made of the same stuff as the rocks in the Gusev crater on the red planet. So what makes the tiny rock dubbed Black Beauty so important? Well, for one, it's the first time we are sure that we have our hands on a piece of the Martian crust. That alone is pretty exciting. But it also establishes a baseline for what Curiosity should be looking for on its mission up there. Plus, its age is a huge deal. 4.4 billion years ago, Mars was basically a baby. Scientists believe this little meteorite will tell our terrestrial experts what kind of volcanic activity was occurring on Mars when it was only 200 million years old, right after the whole solar system formed. As far as that's concerned, scientists have thus far found that there might have been water on the early surface of our neighbor, as well as isotopes of oxygen, perhaps left from the interaction of black beauty with the Martian atmosphere. Amazing and relevant because NASA just launched MAVEN, a probe designed to test that same atmosphere. There's still a lot to learn from this little rock. The published findings are just one of many papers to come, though there won't be any on Martian life from this little double. Funnily enough, meteorites are easily contaminated, so once a human touches a meteorite rock, it's ruined. This one was bought at a market in Morocco. Africa is a hotbed for meteorite discoveries, but scientists say that they prefer Antarctic space rocks because humans don't usually come in contact with them. We can learn so much from these little rocks. Have you ever found a meteorite or thought you did? What did you do with it? Tell us about it in the comments and check out other videos over here for more science space stuff and subscribe for more D News.